On today's show, we've got something cute and cuddly, and no, it's not me, although I am pretty cute and cuddly. Hi, I'm Andrew Cawthorn. You're watching Mashup. Phil Barbado has spent the last few years making cute plush creatures, and now he's presenting them in their natural environment with Plushozoic, an exhibit going on this weekend at Gallery 5. We caught up with Phil to find out more about his cute and cuddly creatures. Amanda from Gallery 5 came to me and said, uh, we'd like you to do a, a, an installation of your plush in this new uh, shop space. Um, and she said, she, uh, we want you to do your creatures in their natural environments. From there, I just kind of went to natural history exhibits. What, it, what it's going to be is a, a, an exhibition of um, my creations in their natural environment, seen in the Plushozoic era, which is the current era of of these. So it, it's sort of a pseudo-scientific um, exhibition of the creatures, and I've got um, some ancestral creatures. I'm going to have some some displays and some pictures from an archaeological dig and some bones, stuff for creations, skeletons, timelines, things like that. So been doing them for, I guess it's about 10 years. That's part of what the Plushozoic thing is. I, I, I've just kind of made up this Plushozoic era starts in 2000 and goes to the present, you know, through the present. And that's about when I started making these things. I hope to get some laughs. Um, I'm really kind of getting into writing the scientific exposition and, and the stories behind the creatures and stuff and, and stories of the evolution. So I, and I'm hoping people will laugh because I'm trying to I'm trying to make it kind of absurd and comical. Um, I'm not making a statement on anything, but I really want people to just enjoy it and smile. That's what I try to do with my creatures. I just want people to smile. If they don't, you know, if they get it, they smile right away when they see it. I kind of know when, when people see my stuff and they, they like it. Um, so I, I want to kind of extend the same thing for the show, too. I just want people to like it and, and have fun. Plushozoic opens this Friday, September 4th at 7 p.m. in Gallery 5's new craft space, Gala Lilies. The exhibit is on display until September 25th. For more information or to purchase one of Phil's creatures, go to philbarbado.com. Today's featured poster is When Dinos Ruled RVA, this Friday, September 4th at 7 p.m. in the Lucent Phoenix Resource Center at Gallery 5. When Dinos Ruled RVA is a public arts project and faux archaeological dig. There once was a rebellion buried ceramic dinosaur bones around the city, and maps will be placed near the dig sites with clues to help people find them. When Dinos Ruled RVA will include dino-themed refreshments, prizes, t-shirts, posters, and much more. That does it for us. Please, as always, send your story ideas to mashupatrichmond.com. It's kind of hard to find stuff going on, so kind of need your help here. Anyway, till next time, I'm Andrew Cawthorn.